once wrote about different objects of power that he called sentinel artifacts. But I was never able to find out exactly what they were. Hey, welcome back lads. So we have found some real interesting information here in Vanguard Zombies new map Shinonuma, and this is absolutely insane because it's more than just a little reference or easter egg. This connects the Dark Aether storyline back to the Black Ops 4 Chaos story, which until now we've always thought was completely separate, a separate story in a different universe. It's a story about mythology like Greek and Norse gods, stuff like that, and yeah, it turns out to be all connected to what's going on right now. So as you heard in the intro, there is an intel radio in Shinonuma that directly mentions the character Alistair Rhodes from the Chaos story, and the Sentinel artifacts, which were basically these artifacts with supernatural powers, and they look very similar to the mirror artifact that you get at the end of the Shinonuma easter egg quest. Also, a little thing I want to point out is that the final Chaos map, Ancient Evil, had these big ass red crystals all over the map, which are very similar to the Dark Aether crystals that we have in Vanguard, where the Dark Aether is red. So essentially what this is trying to tell us is that the events of the Chaos story did and have already happened in the current Dark Aether story because the Chaos story took place before World War One. so it's history as to what's already happened, you know, Vanguard being World War II, Cold War being Cold War, but the most interesting thing about this is actually how it's going to affect the story going forward into the next Black Ops game, which we already know is going to pick up five years after the events of Cold War. You can probably hear it and I can feel it that my throat is still not 100%, my voice is still recovering, but let's continue on because funnily enough I have been thinking a lot recently about this, about how the zombie story in the next Black Ops game might do something similar to the Chaos story, like in its kind of themes and stuff, because we've We've already known since the end of Cold War that the story is going to go down this mythological route, you know, with the Forsaken and then all the Dark Aether entities and demons reawakening in the Super Easter Egg. And of course, the entire point of Vanguard Zombies is to kind of introduce us to more of that kind of stuff, like the demons and creatures that have been warring for power in the Aether. And the next game is going to mix all of that same stuff into the continuation of the Samantha Maxis and Richthofen stuff. Which which is going to be really interesting, and don't forget Dr. Peck trying to recover the inversion warheads from the Pacific Ocean, so, you know, Cold War kind of got there in the end, but it started off a lot more science fiction with, you know, like, teleporters, wonder weapons, experimental technology, and we've seen zombies do that before, and I think the future is going to be like that, kind of like Black Ops 2, Black Ops 3, where the zombie story mixes together those sci-fi elements and then those mythological elements at the same time, you know, think of like Mob of the Dead where it's all supposed to be about hell and kind of biblical things like that, you know, it's hell, the gates of hell and Cerberus, stuff like that. Then you have Origins, which is like a World War One battlefield, but then you have these, you know, 115 generators and massive ass robots, but then the robots are named after Norse gods. And then you have the staff wonder weapons that are also like kind of mythical. So it kind of mixes stuff like that together all into one crazy storyline. So yeah, I think Black Ops 2024 is gonna go down that route and that's gonna be really really epic but that's about all my voice can handle for today so stay spicy and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers. Alistair! That artifact. It's stuck. Finds you worthy. Her hand is yours. Watch your back, Mademoiselle! The winged steed will lead you. Your father, he waits you. 